can you overcome PTSD? How can you overcome? Can I tell you the way you can overcome it? The way you can defeat it? You got to put God's PTSD on your PTSD. So, so PTSD, I, I take the P, the P stands for not post-traumatic. No, no, it ain't that. It's, it's pulled down. It's on the screen. Pull down every thought that doesn't agree with God's word. Look, look at 2 Corinthians chapter 10, verse 4. I got Bible for you. Look at it. Look what he says. We use God's mighty weapon, not worldly weapons. Look what he says. To knock down or to pull down or to tear down. Look what he said. The stronghold of human reasoning and to destroy false arguments. Look, the T is teach your thoughts. Oh, this is good. To obey the word. Can we can teach a lion? We can teach an elephant. We can teach a we can house break a dog and teach a dog not to not to use the restroom in our home. How is it that we can train all these beasts? And how can we know how to create iPads? How can we know how to design YouTube? How is it we can learn to build airplanes and go all the way down in the abyss under the water? And I can't train my mind. Look at Second Corinthians chapter ten, verse five. Look how look what he says. We destroy every proud obstacle that's what keeps us away from God pride keeps us away from God anger keeps us away from God what keeps us battling with our PTSD what keeps us in our stupor in our mess because we feel like I, I know I, I'm mad that it's happening to me I'm mad that I'm going through this but no God comes and God comes to help us to give us a strength to tear down every proud obstacle that keeps people from knowing God oh you know him as a savior but do you know him as a deliverer yeah. look, look at Philippians chapter chapter 4 verse number 8 look what he says he said and now dear brothers and sisters look at Paul he said look dear brothers and sisters one thing one final thing look what he says fix your thoughts on what is true and honorable and right and pure and lovely and admirable he says think about these things that are excellent and worthy of praise Paul says he give us the remedy he tells us how to combat this he tells us what we ought to do he said I gotta set my mind on those things that are true we keep thinking about the false God said think about the truth you gotta counter your negative thoughts S, the S here it is the S is for not syndrome but the S is for snatch your shield mm, boy. after these things the word of the Lord came to Abram in a vision look what God says Fear not, Abram. Here it is. I am your shield. You, you got, if you're going to overcome PTSD, you got to learn to snatch your shield. You got to, you got to, when I snatch my shield, God literally stands at the, at the entrance way of my heart and my mind. And it pulls down all the, nope, that's not coming. Nope, that's not. See, see, we often have a praise break over the things that God, that God did for us. What about thanking God for the things that you didn't know that he shielded your mind over? Come on. D, the D is for deposit your dividend. Dividend is an individual share of something that is distributed. God says, I got something to give you. And he gave it to us. But what good is it if I don't deposit it? What am I trying to tell you? God told Abraham, I'm going to protect you and I'm going to give you provision. You got to deposit that thing. And if you're going to do bout with all that stuff going on in your mind, you got to know God will take care of me. You got to know that things may be bad right now, but trouble don't last always. You got to learn to deposit your dividend. Yeah, you do.